No, this is your clutch. I know where the clutch is. Right, do you want me to show you how to do this or not? Yes, but I know where the clutch is. Okay, fine. All right, you do it yourself, okay? Fine. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? You can't park here. Uh, I'm just here to pick it's up private Sarah. property. Now turn around, get the hell out of here. Come on. Okay. Move it. Yep. Uh, okay, uh, you know what though? I think I'm just gonna wait right here. You can go back to doing your guard the cornfields thing. This is Officer Moore at the gate. We got an issue here. Hey, listen, asshole, this is a restricted area. I told you, get the hell out of here. Hey, hey, you just wait right there. I told you, move it. It's like I was trying to say, I'm just here you to pick up- Did you not see that sign? Oh, look at that. That's kind of hard to miss. I'm authorized to use deadly force. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, what's going on? <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Whitaker. It's, it's what, fine, Jim. Do you know this asshole? Yeah, he's with me. He's with me. Sorry, ma'am. I, I on, didn't know go. that. It's fine. Honestly, I apologize. Shh. Oh, and Jim. Deacon. I'm not with her. She's with me. Hold on tight. Why do you always do that? Do what? Act like such a dick. Oh, come on. He started it. What are you, five? Hey, watch the clutch. Remember, you gotta give it enough gas, rev up the RPMs. I got this. Yeah, I can hear. Where are we headed? Over to the dam. That's a nice, quiet road, right? With you driving? No. Are we still going out tonight? You said something might come up. Uh, crap, yeah. Uh, Boozer and the boys want to ride down to Klamath State, visit Jack. So you're gonna blow me off to go see some guy in prison? Jack's not some guy. I know, I know. I was kidding. Every time I'm on a bike with you, some idiot in a truck tries to run us off the road. Oh my god, no, 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 listen, 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 you did great, you did great. Uh, most people, they would have panicked, they would have oversteered, and that would have gotten us killed. I almost did get us killed. I was, <sighs> no, no. I wasn't paying attention, and I was distracted. Hey, it's okay, it's okay. Just breathe, you're okay. Wait a second, what did, what did you mean, distracted? No, it's just stuff going on at work, it's nothing, I just... Oh. Okay, no, I just thought maybe you uh, saw my new patch. What? No. No, Matt? Wait, you, you quit the club? No, I didn't quit the club. I would never quit the club. Uh, uh, nomad, what it means is, um, well, I'll be less involved from now on. Deke, I didn't ask you to do that. Oh, I know, I know. And if you had, I would have said no. <laughs> you ready to try this again? Yeah, I mean, no, but yeah, I will. Thank you for saving my life. <laughs> well, you know, I do what I can. Hey, hey, the clutch, the clutch. I know what the clutch is. Okay, no, no, the... Deacon. So, uh, do you think your parents are gonna come? To the wedding? I don't know. I mean, you know, I, I thought if I stepped back from the MC that, uh, I don't think it's gonna matter to them, Deacon. But you're gonna, you're gonna at least tell them. Yeah, if you want me to. Look, it's just, I'm not gonna change who I am and who you are to make my uptight mi- Look out! I see them. Hey, are they, are they headed to your work? Oh, shit. What about the MC? Are any of them coming now that you've gone nomad? Oh, I don't know. Uh. Probably been a while since any of them set foot in a chapel. 
Uh, and you really want 27 Harleys rolling up in that little church in Marion Forks? Yeah. You know what? As a matter of fact, I do. Uh, okay. What's going on? I don't know. Miss Whitaker. Yeah. She's been trying to get a hold of you. Says it's urgent. It's always urgent. Let him know I'll be right there. Okay. I gotta go. Hey, hey. <sighs> Sorry. It's fine. It's probably just a fire alarm or something small. Okay. Knock him dead. <clears throat> Love you. Um, just call me later. Addie, I'm sorry. Whatever. Addie, whatever, Ricky. I'm sorry. God damn. Clearance. Clearance. Uh, O'Brien, this is St. John. Come back. O'Brien, this is St. Just answer your goddamn radio. St. John, didn't think I'd hear from you again. Yeah, neither did I. All right, listen, that night you bugged out. You told me that you didn't take any civilians. You just took uh, Nero personnel, feds, people with clearance. I told you. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Listen to me. Sarah, my wife, she had clearance. She had her ID badge with her the night that I put her on your chopper. So just do me a favor, look it up. Sarah Irene Whitaker. She worked at Cloverdale. She had federal clearance. She was doing, uh, I don't know, research pharmaceutical. I don't know what she, the hell she was okay, doing. Just okay. do me. I'll see what I can find. Okay, great. Well, Brian, remember, you owe me. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Brian out. A couple months ago, we were up by Crazy Willie's, just scavenging, you know. Yeah, yeah booze man, what's up? I just, I just wanted to say thanks for the dog. It's no worries, brother. I mean, it, it followed me. You know, wouldn't leave me alone. What was I supposed to do? Hey, get down. Hey. Yeah, sure, it followed you. Jack would have loved that. Uh, no, he wouldn't have, which is why I did it. <laughs> all right, easy, easy, boy. All right, all right, enough, enough. Okay, Nick, I gotta go. You're welcome. Ricky, yeah, I'll bet you got a job for me. Uh, okay, I'll stop by. You can up. So what the hell? I managed to recruit a few guys who I trust, but like me, aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right about your wife. How did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nero personnel, federal officials, and well... Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class four federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit, east of Fort Rock. Take me there. No. No? Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. Oh, I want to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now. 
They're gonna get worse. They're not worse. Something out of this. Ah, go to hell, O'Brien. I don't give a shit about any of that. Boozer, Booze man, come back. Yeah, Dean. Hey, listen, listen to me. Uh, a year ago, we were with Iron Mike. We were thinking about riding south, but the Santium Pass was blocked. There was no way through, and he said that he knew another way. Dean, Iron Mike, he's he's not too happy with us right now. Well, just listen to me. Just listen to me. Do you remember what he said? Iron Mike? Yeah, he was he was bragging about knowing every goat trail in a hundred miles. Said there was a, a trail that went around Mount Thielson, Mount Thielson, I don't know, something. Thielson! Thielson, yeah, that's it. Thielson Pass. Yeah, well, why the hell you... Wait, hero. Shit. You, you've talked to... She's alive? Sarah's alive? Deke? Okay, listen to me. O'Brien, they, uh... Boozer, he found her ID badge. Yeah, Boozer, uh, I, I think that she's alive. D, you never lost hope. You always knew. You never gave up. So what are you gonna do? I don't know, Boozer. I don't know, uh, but... God, if there's even a chance that she's alive, I... Well, I gotta find her. Goddamn right. Uh, shit, I, I gotta go. Uh, Ricky and Addy need, need help putting up a shelf or some goddamn thing. Look, I, I'll see you when you get back to camp. Boozer out. Okay, okay, see you, Booze Man. It's kind of pointless to uh, say anything since I know that you uh, didn't die out here. It's just a habit, I guess. But um, coming out here every so often, talking to you, uh, that was uh, the only thing that kept me sane, you know? So uh, thank you. All right, let's see what the old man's got to say. You know a way over the Tielson Pass. You told me once that I... Uh, told you nothing. Go on, oh, I can't on. help you, Deke. Just draw me a goddamn map. After everything you've done! After everything I've... What about what you've done, old man? Huh? huh? Sherman's you camp, the things that you, you get did... Out of you get out here! You leave me! What if? You could take it all back, huh? What if you could fix it? The fact that I put Sarah on a chopper, I felt relieved. How fucked up is that? Uh, I was relieved. Mike, that's what I've been living with. 
And now you're chasing ghosts. You think finding your old lady, if she's alive, you think that's gonna fix it? Make you whole! I don't know, but I gotta try. All right. If I do this, what you want, show you the way over the pass. You don't come back. All right, you promised me you don't come back. I got you. <sighs> Shit, now I gotta talk to Boozer. to the goddamn freakers. <laughs> While well, we're up here pissing our pants about it. Holy Who's shit. Who's right? I... Uh -huh. huh. Last winter, we were up on Farewell Ridge. We're watching the freaks. Thousands, thousands of them. I mean, too many to count. Yeah, I remember. All I could think was every one of us, man, woman, and child, are now homeless. Bunch of goddamn refugees. Yeah. World belongs to them now. We'll survive. <laughs> yeah, we've been doing that all right. Surviving isn't living. Something Jack used to say. Doesn't matter when you hit the road where you're heading out to, but you damn well better know where you're coming home to. You know, we never talked about it. While we still wore the colors all this time out in the freak show and shit like this didn't matter anymore. Yeah, habit, I think. Last two mongrels on earth, farewell originals. Uh, the biker boys, most badass drifters on the broken road. Damn straight. Yeah, I guess we did become sort of a brand. Uh, we were a lot of things, but we were never a brand. <laughs> <laughs> when we rode out of farewell without Sarah, without Jack or anyone. I knew that we were Leaving everything behind. Everything that mattered was gone. Said this. You're a nomad again, huh? Yep, I guess I am. Come on, Jack. Inside, let's go. If she's out there, you'll find her. Deke, you ready? Yeah, Mike, I'm ready. Meet me at the gate. Don't keep me waiting. Yeah, sure, Mike, whatever you say. Hey. Her big Mike is taking you over the pass? Yep. You really think she's still alive? Billions of people are dead, but somehow she made it. Hey, we made it, didn't we? If I give up now, if I don't, if I don't do this, well, then I'm just gonna end up like, uh... Like us, right? Like Iron Mike, like Boozer? What'd you call us campers? Yeah? You go and you find your woman. You know where to find me.
And you know what? You know what I think, Deacon? I think that you're, you're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here and that scares the hell out of you. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, me too. You ready? Yeah, I want to get the hell out of here. Come on, this way. Okay, I'm following you. Fishing once before, you know. No oh, shit. I got one. Didn't know what the hell to do with it. That sounds like Jack. Now oh, you ran a pretty tight club. Or you boys raised some hell back in the day. But I don't think you murdered anyone. Not in cold blood. It's not murder if they shoot at you first. we used to get through here come summer? A few. Thousands. Too many to count. Highway be bumper to bumper with SUVs and campers chock full of sunburned moms, beer chugging dads, and their snot-nosed kids. Goddamn rainbow of floppy hats, Hawaiian shirts, and flippy flops. All summer long they come. A trail of colorful ants from L.A. to farewell to here. Non-stop. I'm glad I avoided road trips out here that time of year. This is as far as I go. 
Keep following the trail. It'll take you down the mountain, on into the diamond-like valley. I wish you luck. Hope you're right about your old lady still being alive. She is. Well, maybe so. But you gotta ask yourself, Deke. What does it matter if everyone else is dead? You're out there. I'll find you. Mayday! Mayday! Captain Corey? You there? Come in! Mayday! No one's listening. Damn it! Try again! What the hell? <laughs> you. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. I don't know what we would have done without <laughs> you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, hey, okay, all right, all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Uh, man of the hour. Oh, God. <sighs> I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Uh, Rick. Hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <laughs> what? What the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. Freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. He just killed a freaking ranger, dude. Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him here. Uh, you stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No! Listen, 
Stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? Let's go. Following you. Shoots county militia? Look, man, all I know is they feed me. They want me to salute, and yes, sir, I salute and say yes, sir. How big's your outfit? You camp out here? We got a hundred, maybe more. Hard to keep track. Back at HQ, a whole lot more than that. Yeah, okay. Uh, any women? Hell, that what you're about? Well, you can forget it. Girls got rules about that. Frat fratern fratern fraternizing. <laughs> yeah, that. Look, you pull your weight. Follow orders. Nobody messes with you. Women same as the men. Don't matter to the colonel. I'm not... Uh, listen, I, I'm just... I'm looking for some people and a woman that I rode with a year back or so. They would have come over from Silver Lake, and they would have been at one of those Nero refugee camps, I think. Silver Lake? Jesus, man. Silver Lake's been gone a lot longer than that. Yeah, yeah. It's too goddamn easy to lose track of time out of here, you know? Anyway, you guys, uh... Do you pick anyone up? Survivors, I mean, from uh, from the refugee camp? Maybe. Like I said, it's a big freaking army, you know? Ask the captain. He came in across the salt flats, I think. He might know. The captain? Yeah, Corey. He commands the Diamond Lake outpost. We're almost there. This is it. It's Corporal Russell. Open up. Port. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost him. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with a body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. I sort of promised him some food and a safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. And you are? Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. Why, well, you interested? I've been looking to settle down, yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. So, how long you been drifting? Hard to say. Uh, you lose track of time out there, you know? So, uh, where'd you get your gear? Ammo. Well, there was a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Oh, man. Both. They had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Well, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh, Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun? <laughs> oh, yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? Go, go, go! You if gotta you... move your ass! You think you're gonna outrun the freaks? Hell no, you're not! Come on, you gotta work! Here. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? 
I can recruit you. But the Colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Oh, Jesus. Jesus, motherfucker has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. He doesn't look like you militia. My dead grandma can run fast. Hey, uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, um, man, name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit. Deacon St. John? Is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. All right, listen. You wait. see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man, uh, playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, <laughs> uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday. Okay, yesterday. I've, been I've been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> Uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Jesus, that dude's fucked up. He wouldn't remember Sarah if she slapped him in the face. Come on, Sarah, come on. Where the hell are you? You're here. Somewhere. Maybe in these tents. Maybe in here. Nope, not here. Cute drawings. Oh God, I'm glad Sarah and I never had kids. Check this one. Yeah. The infirmary. Yeah. I mean, with her background, that's where she would be, right? Mm. God damn it, she's not here either. Mm. It's gotta be the one. Sarah? Sarah, you in here? Shit, not here. God damn it, she's not here. She's not here, but... Right, yeah, yeah, it couldn't be that easy. How could it? Say, John, are you on this channel? Corporal Russell said you had a radio. Move, move, Yeah, move. yeah, uh, I'm here. You can run fast. Meet me at the gate. One, two, one, two. On my way. Two. Follow the cadence. Yes, sir.